What's up, people? Man, this is Boxing Combo with my official prediction on the Yadakis Camboa versus uh, Rogers Matagua tomorrow night on HBO. Free boxing after dark on HBO, man. It will be awesome. You have the Camboa versus Matagua. Then you have Juan Ma Lopez versus Steve Luano. These cats, you know, there's so much hype. There's so much talk about Juan Ma Lopez, about Camboa. You know, everybody wants these two cats to meet at one point or another because it's going to be explosive. It's going to be awesome, man. These two cats are dynamite, and y'all know that it's just amazing, these two cats, because they're, you know, it's not, you know, it's not even all the pure talent. It's just these two guys just go in there like, they're like Dragon Balls, just throwing bombs at each other, and it's going to be an awesome fight if it ever happens, and it, it may. But now, they have two tough-ass opponents in front of them, man, so let me get at you with that. Some info on Mr. Rogers Matagua. He's 26. I mean, I'm sorry. He has 26 wins, 12 losses, 18 KOs. He's 30 years old. Um, born in Doduma, Tanzania, of Tanzania nationality. Now living in the States, fighting out of Philly, Pennsylvania. He's 5 foot 5 inches, now fighting at 126. Yorikas Camboa. This guy has a lot of history too, man. Uh, Yorikas Camboa, he's 28 years old, out of Guantan uh, Guantanamo, Cuba, hometown now, living in Miami, fighting out of Florida. He's 5 feet, also 5 inches. He has 16 wins, 0 losses, 14 KOs, over 250 amateur fights, man, mad experience. Uh, won a gold, he's a gold medalist, won a gold medal at 2004 Olympics as flyweight, then at 2005 won a bronze medal world championship in man yang china at featherweight and i'm thinking why you know all the experience and and you know the lack of of defense that Kamboa has the reason he's able he's able to get away with the lack of defense is because he has such incredible explosive offense that it's just a and this dude is born to be a star man him juan Ma lopez this can be big if it ever happens um uh, at least for you know real hardcore fans you know I mean, uh, for me, I, I would really love to see that fight if it, if it ever goes down. But right now, my prediction is Camboa versus Matagua. You know what? The thing is with Camboa, it's the same with Juanma. These guys are just explosive, just really anxious to get in there and trade, you know, punches. And they're always trying to look for a knockout. You can see the record of Camboa, 16 wins, 14 by knockout. Um, Camboa... You know, he can get frustrated. This, if this, you know, they forget a guy that can on Juan Man. They're so anxious, you know, just, they forget these fights will, will last for 12 rounds. And they can tire themselves out or they can get frustrated. This Matagua guy has great stamina. Matagua guy has a great chin. You know, uh, if Camboa goes in there and he's able to knock him out early, it, it can happen. Because Camboa, I think he can hit, he can hit, I think Camboa hits even harder than Juan Ma. Uh, but Gamboa, what if he can't knock Matagua out in the earlier rounds? You know, it could end up being a 12 round uh, fight and who knows, this could get, this could go even worse for Camboa if Camboa doesn't knock him out quick. Because Camboa, if it goes into the later rounds, I understand he has great stamina, but you know, his, his defense, he has less defense than Juan Ma. And Juan Ma, y'all saw all the trouble he had, how exhausted he was. and. He got some. He got some good hit. You know, uh, Matagua got some good hits on him after Juanma got real tired. And Camboa, you know, his cat. You know, he's just so open. He's been hit before. He's been down before. He's never been hurt. I've never seen him hurt though. Um, so you, you never know what can happen with a guy like Matagua. Now, if Camboa is smart. If Camboa has been studying Matagua, and Camboa sees that he can knock Matagua out, and he starts to box Matagua and try to box him and win a 12-round decision, that can happen. But you never know, because he's cats, you know, uh, Cambo, he, he's like all action, man. This, is, this dude is just action, so I think he's going to try to go for the knockout. And in my eyes, I think that Cambo can knock Matagua out. I'll tell you that. Uh, that's uh, My prediction is that, and this is for the contest, you know, I'm going to give you a round. I usually don't really give rounds, but I'm going to give rounds, you know, for the fun of it and, 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 for the, uh, and for the contest, which is real cool, man. Anyway, I think... Um, Camboa will knock Matagua out in the seventh round. And it's funny because it's pretty close to the other prediction I did with the Juan Ma Lopez versus Steve Luano, which I predicted that I think that Juan Ma Lopez can knock Steve Luano out in the sixth round. Um, but y'all gotta watch a vid so y'all know why I predict that. 
But in this prediction, Camboa versus Matagua, I think Matagua, I mean, I think Camboa is going to come in there with those fast, crazy uppercuts, and he's going to try to knock Matagua out, and I believe he will achieve that. He will achieve uh, knocking Matagua out in the seventh round. That's my prediction. Knockout, seventh round, winner, Mr. Eurekis Camboa. It will be awesome. And let me see if I can, you know, give you the results afterwards. I'll try to do that. Let's see, because I might have a, a friend of mine's over, and you know, you could get, you could get uh, caught up talk, you know, talking and BS and whatever, you know. But I'll try to get at you, man. You know, a lot of hardcore fans, you got to check this fight out because this is hot. This is fire. And and then these are the fights where you don't see all the fuss and all the craziness, man. These are just two young and up and coming cats that they don't, you know, they're not going to play around in the ring, man. These cats come to fight. They come to knock people out. And, uh,. Sometimes that's good for him. Sometimes it may be bad, but it's going to be awesome. That's all I know, and I'm going to be watching that. And uh, much respect to all you cats. That's my prediction. I got Camboa winning by knockout in the seventh round, bro. Peace out, man. Y'all know.